Senator, welcome. Minister, that Thank hasn't hasn't been possible before. Do you have any confidence that you might yet get that bill passed? Uh, well, certainly I will be negotiating, as I have always done, in good faith with the crossbenchers. Uh, but I think today the Prime Minister has made the government's position very clear. The Parliament is being recalled on the 18th of April uh, for the sole purpose of giving consideration to the bill to restore the Australian Building and Construction Commission and, of course, uh, in the event that goes through the Registered Organisations Commission, uh, our intent is to see these bills passed because they are good policy. Uh, but again, as the Prime Minister made clear today, the time for playing games is over. I will negotiate in good faith, uh, but I'm not about to tolerate amendments just for amendment's sake. These bills must be passed. Right, so open to sensible and constructive amendments. I will negotiate in good faith. And uh, apart from their own political mortality, when you're sitting across the table from these senators, what other form of persuasion do you bring that you haven't been able to bring to bear before? Well, for us, this is an important economic reform um, and sits very nicely with the government's economic agenda. I mean, this, the building and construction industry is the third largest employer in Australia. Uh, the sector employs in excess of a million Australians through the thousands of small businesses. So when you're talking about growing Australia, increasing productivity, but at the end of the day, creating more jobs for Australians, uh, you cannot have a sector that for decades now has shown uh, it willfully and quite deliberately uh, does not comply with workplace law. So we're here to clean up the sector, uh, but at the end of the day in cleaning up the sector to ensure that we grow the sector and ultimately contribute to more jobs for Australians. All right.